Folks, this special broadcast of AEAC wouldn't have been possible without the support of Air Guns of Arizona, Air Gun Depot, Pyramid Air, and JSB Predator International. And you know the best way to thank them. Hey guys, catching up with Shane from Air Guns of Arizona in the FX booth. Good to see you, buddy. It's been how long? So a couple months, October, right? Extreme Ventures? Yeah, Extreme. That was a good time. Yeah. It's good to get to know Always you then. A pleasure. <laughs> I've uh, recruited Shane to take us through a very special gun, and I haven't shared this with you guys yet, but I have had one of these at the house for a couple of weeks now. In fact, I think, it's, I think it was their last synthetic because you guys are sold out, again, of another FX product. And this is the FX Streamline. You know, we know FX is one of those organizations that never rests on its laurels. They're always moving forward. They do something amazing, and then they take a very brief time out, and then they do something amazing again. And of course, most recently, it was the FX Impact, which it took the extreme bad trust, right? Ted, Ted, Ted Bear? Ted, 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 Ted. And I'm guessing you guys are probably sold out of those as well. They are. So we, when I say we, you and me, AEAC, are very fortunate to have one of these in our possession, and I'll be doing a full review on it. But before I do, I just wanted to ask Shane, you know, what makes this gun so different in the FX lineup? Now, the reason, it's kind of a loaded question because so much of this is the same as all other yes, FX, but there's one thing, actually probably two things that I can think of that are very different, and I will turn it over to you, Shane, to kind of take us through it. And, yeah, so like you said, you're getting a lot of the same features you are in the F and you'll find in all these other FX rifles. Like what, for someone that's not familiar this gun with is an FX? Regulated, same smooth twist barrel that's in all the rifles. Mm -hmm. You got the side lever, biathlon style bolt, mm -hmm. two stage, fully adjustable trigger. Mm -hmm. It's a 22 caliber, 11 shot rotary magazine. Okay. 25 caliber, 10 shot rotary magazine. Okay. Power adjustable. Good shot counts in 22 okay. caliber. You're getting, you know, 65, 70 yeah. good shots. Same thing in 25 caliber. But there's a but. There's something really but. different about this gun. But what this is gun it? This starts at 9.99. So you get all those features at 9.99 so with a synthetic model. For a thousand bucks, guys, we get the FX, the smooth twist, smooth twist barrel, a shrouded barrel, a dual stage trigger, a regulator. Side lever cocking. How many rounds in the magazine again? And 22 caliber, it's 11 shots. 11 shots, and this thing is extraordinarily light. What is it? I'm guessing right about six, six pounds. Feels about six pounds. Unbelievable. And it's nice and thin, so it feels fantastic in hand. It is, yeah. We're very excited to start carrying this gun. We got them back in uh, December and been selling out of them as fast as we're getting them. Got another, sh another shipment coming in February. So yeah, this is gonna be a fantastic gun for FX uh, in 2017. I'm excited, I can't wait to get to review it. Now, or get to reviewing it, I'm gonna put you on the spot. Oh, no. I don't know if you, can't, if you can answer this question, but if, if you can't, that's cool. Uh -huh. But you know, a guy like me or people at home are wondering, okay, well if you get all the goodies that are in an FX, you know, how are they doing it? What are they, you know, what am I, what am I missing? What am I losing by only spending a grand on an FX that, gets, that incorporates all the FX goodies into it? Honestly, absolutely nothing. This gun, right out of the box, is ready to go. Very simple design, very easy to work on if you ever need to get in and replace an O-ring. Um, average person can do it themselves. One thing we forgot to mention is also half-inch UNF by 20 thread. So cool. the guys that want the moderators, keep them whisper quiet. That gives you the capabilities of doing that as Does well. it need it? Do you feel like it needs it? You know, in my instances, in the way I shoot, I don't need it. But if I'm in a backyard and I don't want to disturb my neighbors, yeah, I'd slide on my moderator and uh, you know, make it go click. Very, very cool. Well, that's it guys, an affordable FX with everything that we've come to know and love about FX for about a grand. Yes. Awesome. Yeah, Shane, thank you. thanks for taking thanks us for through it. By. You bet your brother. Right. There we go, Leave you hanging, threw it in, oh, boom. There we go. Guys, I was just on my way out of the Daystate Brocock booth the day Air Guns of Arizona is running and I saw this sitting in the corner. So I wanted to grab Darren real quick and the reason being, I actually have one of these at home. Air Guns of Arizona sent it some time ago for review, but the one I have looks a little bit different than this. It's about that much longer, and, and you're gonna see the review of that coming soon on the channel. I promise, I've just been totally overwhelmed with all these projects coming at us, but that's good for you guys at home and me too, so if you could give me the mulligan about that. But Darren, if you could, 
This sure. is different than what I got. What yeah, the heck's yeah, going yeah, on yeah. here? Well, this is going to be our bushbuck carving. Okay. And what we found with the original bushbuck, the one you have now. What are we going to call that? Well, the bush, maybe the, the bushbuck magnum. The magnum, the, the high power, magnum. the extreme, exactly. something crazy like that. The yeah, I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're going to do this is a carving version of the gun. The one drawback of the bushbuck is obviously the length. It's a heavy gun. Yeah, it's long and heavy, especially for a, a tall guy like me. And not everybody needs 600 foot pounds. Yeah. You know, the average shooter might, you know, for black bear, mount lion, whatever. What are we going after? It's not elk. Yeah. They only need the 450. So this gun at 45 caliber will do 450 foot pounds, uh -huh. and even in the carving lane. Additionally, we wanted to launch this because this will be the platform for the 357. Very cool. We don't have the specs on that yet, yep. but those are forthcoming. Yep. And uh, again, we'll launch this in the 357 caliber, the 45, and of course the 45 Mac. Now I'm going to hit you up with some questions because there may be some guys and gals at home that are powder burner hunters watching the SHOT Show coverage, sure. and they're looking at me and they're looking at you and they're going, what the heck is this air gun? He just said 357 and 452 and you know, are we shooting squirrels and rabbit with this thing? Oh, what is this gun used for? This is a proper hunting rifle. Um, the, the drawback of air guns in the past is the humanity of the hunt, and you want to do a humane kill. And there's never been air guns typically powerful enough. They've all been one-offs, custom-made, and this is a true production rifle now. Uh -huh. So in 45 caliber, and you can't take game. We have hunters that have taken elk, black bear, uh, Mountain Lion. Uh -huh. We have a couple videos on our website. I was, I was just going to say, if you don't believe it, check out the Air Guns of Arizona's YouTube site, YouTube channel, and their website. And they, ha I've seen videos of bear, mountain lion, all sorts of crazy, goofy stuff over in Africa. Sure. All these names I can't pronounce. So you guys are taking it down with this gun. We are, and and quickly. And the advantage of this for a lot of for a lot of firearm or powder burner guys, uh -huh. they've done everything there is to do. They've hunted all the animals they, they want to hunt. Uh -huh. It's a brand new experience. This is a true hunter's gun. I mean, you have to get within 120 to 150 yards yep. when you're shooting with this versus a 400 yard shot. Right. So there's a lot more to it, hunting with an air rifle. But that being said, I, you know, I don't know if you can take game out to these to distances like this, but I have seen these guns firsthand be deadly accurate out to 200 yards. Sure. Again, you want to be careful what you're shooting at those I get it. I'm just kind of letting the guys know at home. <laughs> exactly. The precision and the quality and the accuracy is there. Exactly. And we're looking forward to your review on the gun. Me too. I can't wait. Can, hopefully you can show the accuracy on the gun is exactly what, exactly what we claim. I will. I'll make you proud. All right. Darren, thanks Thank for you. spending time with us, Thank man. I appreciate you.